Hello and welcome back to River Mountain Homestead. I have finished the last of the piers this morning and with this little bunker that we decided to build in the corner, storm shelter, root cellar, whatever you want to call it. Figured I'd drag you guys along on that. I started over here just a minute ago with a shovel. Uh, it's already afternoon and sun's nice and bright. But figured I'd drag you guys over here and I guess we're going to call this our fallout bunker. I don't know. It's just, it grew a little bit after we discussed it last night. So it's going to end up being a six foot by eight foot. And the ceiling is just under six foot high. So decent sized little room. Definitely a good little tuck away spot. I'm going to have to make a trip down to our off grid cabin. I know I've got a big piece of metal down there that'll work great for the door opening. So I've got to go find that, hopefully, and see what size my door needs to be. But right now, today, I'm just going to start digging a little bit here and get this floor kind of flattened out and figure out exactly where my footer is going to get poured to tie these two walls together here. But I just wanted you guys to be able to follow along. It's not super pretty, but I definitely do believe it's going to work. We're tied in through the concrete footer on each side. This is not super thick, but it's not going to have a whole lot of weight on it, so I'm not real worried about it. Uh, I can finish leveling that floor out a little bit, and then it'll end up with probably just some visqueen or something on the floor. But maybe tomorrow, uh, if it doesn't rain, I think we got a chance, so maybe I can get some blocks down on this guy. I don't know who's shooting down there. Maybe I can get some blocks on this guy. I'm going to try to run to the cabin this afternoon. I got another hour or two of daylight. Let's see if I can find that piece of iron I need for the overhead on the door. But not too bad for a part one. Well, I made it down here to the cabin. And I've got to scrounge around over here in my junk pile and see if I can find that special piece of metal for that door overhead. Door. Right where I left. I may have to run over it with the truck, try to flatten it back out a little bit. Here we got there one, two. It's almost three foot wide. That'll give us a little over a two foot wide door opening there. Perfect. Here. In the goat pan, it's going to be my piece of wire that goes in the ceiling where I pour the concrete. If anybody remembers the video when we done this, it's been a few years back. This is how we fed the baby goats so that the mamas couldn't get to their feed because the little ones could jump through the hoop here and get inside to eat when mama goat couldn't get in there. There's actually another piece of cattle panel over there that may be big enough. I may just snatch that one right there. It's already clear and ready to go. And if we ever need that one, I think that'd be big enough. I like it. Perfect. It's hard to beat free sources as Papa Pepper calls them 
but any resources you got laying around that you can reuse man i'm all about it because just these two items right here saved me lord knows how much probably 60 80 bucks anyway the price of steel is pretty high right now i got a couple more things i gotta grab while i'm here i'm gonna grab it today but if we work on rabbit houses this weekend i've got that piece of tin there and another one underneath the house right there that should be more than plenty to take care of those rabbit houses good morning and top of the day it is a brand new day this morning and Miss B is excited that the sun is shining and beaming down on us. It was uh, about 19 here this morning, so we're starting to warm up a little bit. I had to take a break yesterday and take care of some family stuff and help some folks out. But Miss B is glad that I'm back to work with her. So we are going to slide back in on this today. We've got that footer poured and now we're gonna try to get them blocks laid. I didn't want to break this up in too many videos. Uh, I'll probably have to stop after today and then we'll get another shot when we actually get the roof and the door and everything done for it. But for now, we're gonna start cutting some blocks and laying some blocks. If she'll allow me to get anything done. Isn't that right, Miss B? You crazy kid. You're a goofball. What are you gonna do today? Nothing? Absolutely nothing? You're just gonna get your belly rubbed? Now that I've got the bottom base row cut, I figured up my height for what I wanted to end up with against the wall there and got shots on everything. We had this angle to contend with here, but we got those cut. Once we get a quarter half inch worth of mud up underneath the bottom of them there, we'll get everything leveled out. I'll start on this corner right here and get me a grade set with it and then we'll follow off of it and go level i believe my door is going to fall in this neighborhood here somewhere and i'll figure that out here in a minute but i do have that plate so that we went and scored at the cabin It's definitely not finished, but I definitely have gotten a good start on it. I know Miss B interrupted me several times. She hears me talking now and she's on her way. She just, she's a jealous little booger and she likes to be in the videos. But 
we got a good start on it. Uh, it is Friday afternoon. I'll get this uploaded here shortly. And I don't do much on weekends. I try to spend that with family. Uh, we may get on that rabbit coop a little bit tomorrow. Rabbit hutch, whatever you want to call it. I've got big plans on Monday. I'm going to bring you guys along for that. That should be pretty interesting and exciting. Something a little different. And we can't trust the weatherman to even say what next week's going to be like. But hopefully I can get on this next week. Uh, one day finish out. Come here, BB. Come in through the door. Right there. There you go. Good girl. And uh, so hopefully next week I'll get these walls up and finished out. And then I'll have to make a trip to get everything I need uh, for the ceiling. And uh, yeah, get a door built. I I've got a couple of ideas in mind on the door. Uh, nothing set in concrete yet. No pun intended. But uh, definitely headed in the right direction. So... Hopefully here, less than a week, we'll have this thing finished out. Hi, baby. You need some lovings? What a brat. You're a good kid, though. But thanks for tuning in, guys, and we will catch y'all on the next one. Isn't that right, B?